the fact is that even with a solid plan nothing moves without buying how do you advise leaders to build momentum and support across their organization for AI adoption? Well, let me let me draw a parallel quickly, um, Swapnil, to um, another uh, domain where I believe the same approach works. Um, you know, a lot of what we do at uh, EGN is in security space, and in a way, is, um, encouraging people to adopt security tools is kind of similar as encouraging them to encourage uh, to adopt AI tools. Let me explain that quickly. You know, uh, when pe- uh, trying to get people to adopt security tools, there's there's a certain amount of reticence. There's a certain amount of, well, I don't understand this. It's going to make my job worse. And the way to address that is twofold. Number one, education. You need to tell a, you need to tell a team why it is that you're doing what you're doing. In the case of security, prevent breaches, prevent you know costly um, you know uh, breaches that impact customers. In the case of AI. Well, it's in, you know, it's improving, uh, improving processes. It's doing our jobs quicker. It's doing our jobs more accurately. Um, and the second thing on top of education is to identify those champions. Cause I think that one of the best things that any organization can do is find those people who are already bought into the idea of new tools. And it's the same whether it's a security tool or an AI tool. They're bought into it. They understand the benefit and they in effect become the profit for you. And the more of these people you have, the better. But of course, those people have to genuinely believe that what they're what what you're proposing is is the way forward. But again, I think if a company's done its homework and they have a good story, they have the why, they have the how, and they have the what, then that becomes a relatively a relatively straightforward exercise. But it requires uh, cooperation at all levels, um, Swapnil, from the executive level right down to the tactical level and day to day operations.